Hey there guys, I'm meteorologist Robert Spett. I want to talk about what's going on out here, not only in the tropics specifically, but I did get a question uh, from one of our, our watchers here at Westback Weather. Thank you very much. George Stump, I think, I'm not sure if I'm saying your name right. He's out of Palawan. He said some friends went down there for a medical transport off the reef. Several people went missing during that. A helicopter went down. In recent with the shear line has been invaded in the Philippines. There's actually been several downed aircraft the last couple weeks. So very dangerous flight conditions with some of these pop-up storms. And I just wanted to touch into that because, you know, he sincerely asked, you know, how is the weather out there, especially since we've been talking about this tropical depression, uh, was a tropical depression. Now that things kind of falling apart, still bringing some passing showers out there uh, just off the coast of Malaysia. But most of this is staying south of Palawan. And even if we just kind of look ahead in the um, forecast here, let's uh, actually scoot this ahead through the satellite picture. But we're going to go into the uh, kind of zoomed in. You see those showers just off of the coast of Palawan wrapping around here as we go ahead through Tuesday and Wednesday. But overall, the monsoonal flow with those passing clouds just continue to kick up. It is still breezy. Uh, definitely going to be seeing some rough seas in southern areas of the uh, West Philippine Sea here just off the coast of Malaysia. But um, yeah, at least those heavier storms with that minor tropical depression now kind of weakening out there. I hope that everybody involved in that is staying safe and you get some good news uh, soon. I truly, truly do hope that. Um, just wanted to update on that. Otherwise, we pull back the bigger picture, you know, just kind of taking off of that. Uh, monsoonal flow just continuing to dominate. You have the shear line, not really much happening in the tropics out here at this time. In fact, if we just kind of go and take a look actually at the extended uh, forecast from the Climate Prediction Center, kind of see where we do have uh, some of that precipitation in the southern areas of the Philippines, but otherwise it, that's only associated with the leading edge of that monsoonal flow. There's no tropical threat at this time. Long range tropical outlook actually continue to keep things pretty calm. In fact, let's just take a look. Let's uh, pull up kind of the overall moisture flow across this area here. Um, yeah, this is all dry air flowing in like, over the Philippines. You have a couple little streams right in there, but uh, really it is early March and things are staying calm. Thank goodness. I mean, we've had powerful storms this time of year, so it's not like that would be unheard of. Of, but at least for the time being, things out here across the tropics are staying rather calm at this time. So that's good news, especially for all those search and rescue efforts going on at this time, too. Uh, if you have any questions, comments, or suggestions, please let me know. I have a few people that, uh, you know, are super typhoons. David Hicks actually just wrote me. He's one of our super typhoons. Just make sure his name's on there. Uh, my last update, I did change uh, the graphics because I was just using a different show. I forgot to update the Patreon. So big thanks for everybody on Patreon. If you want to support that, or you can become a member here on YouTube, or there's PayPal. There's three different ways you can support this channel. So big thanks for everybody who does do that. I truly, truly can't thank you guys enough. And David Hicks said, you know, I've been doing donating for a, a little bit now may not be anymore that's fine uh, i'm gonna keep your guys' name on here if you to be especially if you leveled up to that super time from level that's ten dollars a month and it really does go a long way to keeping these updates going i actually just tried a um live stream and i was having issues so i'm gonna have to use that patreon money to uh invest in a um better ethernet cord i think or something i'm not sure uh it's I'm still working on it. That's why I usually record these videos instead of do live streams, even though they are in one take and I don't really edit them very much. But yeah, that's the reason why it's just a bandwidth issue. I want to make sure I give you guys the, the best uh, in the least, uh, not the, least, the most useful information. It's not jumping around and loading and stuff like that. Um, sunrise, 610, sunset, 605 a.m. there in Manila. How about that? Always. It's 12 hours. Most time of year, this close to the equator, right? Anyways, that's all for today, guys. As always, thanks for watching. And, of course, stay safe out there. Bye.